Hello beautiful souls, I'm Sai and welcome to Libra Tarot for the month of July. We'll dive into your person's energy, feelings, intentions and possible outcome ahead. L let's see what rest of July has for you. This reading is meant to provide insights and guidance. If it does resonate with you, please affirm it with a like and a comment. Your support means a lot to us. Okay, let's get started. So in terms of the overall energy, what do we have? So we start off with the 10 of swords. It indicates a period of ending, could be a sense of betrayal or defeat. You may be experiencing some sort of significant loss or painful conclusion in a relationship. Some of you guys could also be feeling stabbed in the back or very much overwhelmed by a series of unfortunate events that you guys have been through. But you got to know that the worst is already over. The difficulties are all already over all that you're supposed to face is all already over clarifying this we have the two of swords it highlights the internal struggle and indecision you guys could be grappling with you need to make a very difficult choice finding balance amongst all this turmoil that you could be facing some of you could be avoiding confrontation and you guys are delaying decision which is leading to all sorts of stagnation and emotional blockage in terms of your career we have the wheel of fortune in the reverse it does suggest a period of setbacks and unexpected changes you might be feeling stuck or you feel like luck is not on your side around this time this sense of frustration and stagnation but as advice you need to be patient and adapt to these changes and let go of all that overthinking in terms of your love life we have the queen of swords so overall energy indicates that you will be confronting the truth head on you can expect clear honest communication to take center stage it's a period of setting boundaries and making well considered decisions the overall energy we have is the page of pentacles some of you guys will be getting in new communication or uh, a message a call um, some sort of news okay which will bring in much needed changes okay it could also bring in clarity for some of you this could be a completely new individual with page of pentacles so moving on to your person's energy towards you your person's energy towards you we have the knight of swords now knight of swords is all about someone wanting to bring in fast changes someone is desperate to re-enter your life or enter your life in terms of that what's their energy towards you at this time this person has a very strong desire for success and recognition in your relationship they want to be more successful with you seeking your attention admiration and acceptance this person wants to stand out and be acknowledged for their efforts in easy words they want to be approved and accepted by you clarifying the overall energy 10 of swords we have the knight of pentacles there has been a slow and steady approach which has led to a sense of frustration and feeling stuck okay with the eight of cups suggest a need to walk away from unfulfilling situations highlighting emotional detachment and search for deeper meaning now with what is going wrong with the moon card there's some sort of confusion illusions hidden fears it does suggest there is an underlying uncertainty and emotional complexity that needs to be addressed. Why do we have the wheel of fortune in the reverse for your career? I think you are waiting for better opportunities but they are not coming in. Okay and that is bothering you. With the page of swords you are just very much defensive around this time. With wheel of fortune I do not see you wanting to take any major risk when it comes to your career, your business, your work life. Okay, when it comes to your love life, when it comes to your love life, some of you guys do feel played. You feel that like this person is up to something, but they are not letting you know about it. Okay, in terms of your relationship with the page of pentacles. Yeah, with the temperance card, someone definitely wants to work things out. They want to be the first one who initiates. They want to be the first one who uh, probably makes a move. Okay the energy towards you we have the knight of swords so you guys can expect a lot of communication a lot of fast changes eight of wands is always about changes transitions transformation okay communication okay 
a, a lot of flirty communication can be expected as well why do we have the six of wands for your relationship well most of you guys can expect this person to treat you well around this time uh, for some of you this could be someone who you've known quite recently uh, it doesn't have to be but some of you it it is mostly someone you've known or met recently okay now moving on to oracle messages what do we have for libra we have time i'm afraid it's too late to take action this could have been a fear with the ten of swords uh, in the past you might have not heard from this person or due to delays you are quite feeling like this is over now that nothing can come out of this or you're holding on to some sort of negative emotion okay when it comes to your person's side what is going on your person's side i'm i'm getting two cards by lying i ripped us apart this person are definitely holding back we also have reveal i want to tell you the truth that is mostly the queen of swords and the knight of swords they do want to be honest and real with you and uh, i'm struggling to find the right path this person was holding back because a lot of other things were going on in their life okay and uh, definitely around this time they do want to work things out with you we have soul contract we have habits we have mis mistakes i wish i could right my wrongs okay that being said let's move on further in terms of that what's your person up to currently we have the herifin card so around this time this person wants to follow tradition structure if if at all they come uh, forward they will want a formal commitment with you they will want to make it obvious and uh, you know they will want to respect the relationship that you guys share the bond that you have they will not want to take it for granted how have they been acting around this time overall energy we have the 5 of cups this person is feeling a deep sense of regret and sorrow and they are missing you a lot fearful of missing a chance of reconnecting why this all is happening we have the 3 of wands libra is focused on their future and personal growth appearing detached or not giving them enough attention clarifying the herifant card for the relationship and how your person approaches we have the 9 of pentacles the person will approach you in a very confident and independent manner they aim to showcase their self sufficiency and hoping to impress you with stability and achievements with the eight of pentacles this person is determined and hopeful to work things out they see potential for renewed connection or partnership and they are filled with optimism and sense of new beginning expect a big shift okay that being said future action what can we guys expect future action i do see three of pentacles let me clarify this one more time well future action for most of you this person is going to be taking that leap of faith which is long due okay with three of pentacles if at all they were holding on to other options that could be their work life that could be a second person that could be a second option they are letting go of all that to be with you okay i know this seems too good to be uh, true but that is what i'm getting okay so far if this resonates i want you to type in 222 for togetherness and like the video to affirm the reading so far okay so in the past what was libra waiting on and what did not go through we have the ace of pentacles followed by the lovers card so libra was eagerly awaiting a significant shift or opportunity for this person to choose them for a serious relationship okay however the awaited commitment did not materialize as expected leading to a sense of disappointment okay this person was majorly emotionally detached okay you guys faced reality and your hopes for deep, a deeper connection and commitment were not fulfilled at the time and it has led to a lot of pain now okay some of you guys in the recent past could have chosen to just walk away or stay away what i mean by recent past could be in the past couple of weeks could be a past month as well okay in terms of that what's this person waiting on this person was waiting to heal fix themselves found some uh, sort of direction in their life before coming forward they wanted to be more um, you know like they want to achieve more in their life before they can choose you completely 
okay they want to heal they want to probably be very confident in themselves before they could approach you that's what, nothing wrong in that okay in terms of what's next for libra and their soulmate for most of you i still believe some of you guys are going to stay closed off to this individual because you you have seen this person treat you badly you have seen this person uh act in a certain way to get something out of you so you guys could be suspicious around this time okay so in terms of what's next how is that they approach you what's next this person definitely takes in that charge this person finally makes that move they will make it quite obvious by uh, putting in that effort taking action and 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 probably choosing you being with you spending time with you okay in terms of what's that they truly want with you what's that they want with you is that they want to build together they want to have a relationship where you know you guys could probably say that they are an equal part of where they are contributing to they are investing they are more aware they are more um, you know like you know if they are in this relationship for the right reasons okay they do not want to just be a part of it by just hanging on they want to literally give in to this okay they want to contribute around this time with the tower card they also want to bring in some changes if at all there are certain habits toxic ways that uh, got in the way in the past they would definitely want to change that they want to change the way they be with you okay that being said let's clarify a few things before moving in next We have the king of cups which tells me around this time this person will want to be as expressive as possible they are coming in fast you, like you don't have to wait for any longer that could also be the card they they, they want to bring in fast changes and they want to they want to make it quite obvious that you are someone they choose and hold on to okay with the ace of pentacles most of you guys i know this is something which is too positive but with ace of pentacles they want to give you a solid offer that could be regarding the future they might want to gift you something to make it obvious that they are serious about you that now this could be in a form of um you know like like something bling bling like could be you know like a necklace could be a ring like could be something that you enjoy okay but you have a gift coming in okay so moving on why do we have the tower and the seven of pentacles the two of swords if at all in the past they were confused they had op like options they did not know what to do they kept probably giving you mixed signals and empty promises then around this time they will make it quite obvious that they want this they want you they see you as a future partner they want to be with you they will want to make it official as well as you move towards the month of september okay so most of you who have struggled in their relationship do not have to do it any longer you're you're moving towards something much more fulfilling and mind you i've taken a hell lot of reversals this connection is meant to go forward okay that being said let's move on to some oracle cards we have intensity the, this the feelings i have for you overwhelm me so i run away to process them so so that is the overall energy i feel I hid something from you and I'm afraid to tell you about it. It is mostly about an option. Okay? My heart is opening and I'm ready. That's what I told you. This person around this time is fully prepared to embrace this relationship, to be a part of it and uh, gesture. I am going to come and sweep you away. That being said, let's move further. what's the best case scenario going to be best case scenario you can expect this person to put in that effort to take charge to uh, probably i mean this this time around they'll be chasing you they'll be the one who wants to work things out they'll be the one who's always behind you you know they'll be the one who's going to make you feel special so it's it's coming in and how soon can we expect this change for most of you this will happen in a span of 10 days could be between 4 to 10 okay but it is coming in sooner than you've imagined 
okay in terms of your energy versus their energy now your energy now you're suspicious you're holding on to your fears doubts you're feeling let down okay this is their energy their energy they, they want to completely free themselves from all this confusion and drama and be more open towards you they do not want to let their fears or, or their doubts or their insecurities or like overwhelm them to a point that they lose you okay in terms of their major focus around this time their major focus around this time is to listen to their intuition we have the high priestess followed by the ace of swords they want to listen to their intuition they want to give into their gut feeling and they want to have more than just a bond okay this will exceed the superficial connection this will exceed the uh, spiritual connection this will uh, exceed the emotional bond or the sexual bond that you people share okay those who genuinely believe in manifestation i want you to close your eyes or uh, take in few deep breaths see yourself visualize yourself happy okay if you want to visualize with your partner you can do it but just visualize yourself happy and fulfilled and in a happy relationship and snap your fingers and just affirm this reading with your like or just you could just pray it's the best case scenario gonna be where do we go from here with page of cups you will be getting that attention that you are waiting on hoping for but you also have a new lover coming you have a solid commitment like coming in i genuinely see most of you guys in a relationship okay i am super super positive on the fact that you guys won't be single for long okay in terms of libra energy what are you people up to right now with four of wands you guys want to stay more focused on your family on your personal values on your religious beliefs okay some of you guys might be out with your friends as well family on a small vacation or, or you plan something soon in terms of this relationship what's up with you you have lost confidence when it comes to this individual you do not want to feel controlled you do not want to control this connection some of you guys might just want to find yourself out of it your current feelings towards this person your current feelings we have nine of cups this person has drained you out you connect them with negative emotion with negative karma sometimes sometimes you feel your cost to even be part of this connection okay so in terms of that what's that you want with this person some of you guys just want to fight them like you just want to give it back if you can overall i think you really want to have that confrontation okay so what's your focus your focus is to enjoy your life is to take one day at a time and you want to be grateful for your journey okay that being said what's the major issue that's been getting in the way major issue is that you both were focused on your own happiness sun card could also be that this person took uh, you for granted uh, it could also be that this person was more about their own success than this relationship with two of wands this person wasn't as focused on you as they should have been and there could have also been some options or some distractions not everyone will have options this person was too direct sometimes they behave like me you know like <laughs> they never sugar coated anything they were too direct to a point that it started hurting you it's it started bothering you okay and uh, sometimes they treated you like they had nothing there are times when they might even have told you that they do not have feelings for you or they do not look forward to you they could have said some bad shit to just get away from it okay so that being said what's the outcome going to be till end of july see i am very clear that most of you guys are going to find yourself in a beautiful relationship okay if you want to give this person a chance it's this person just to clarify how is this person coming forward towards you what is that you can expect with nine of pentacles in the reverse they no longer want to hold on to you or hook you around or play the field they are ready to completely surrender this reading almost looks like a wish fulfillment isn't it with the ace of swords you guys can expect a lot of uh, breakthroughs you can expect a lot of truth coming out surrender communication some straight up shit okay 
what's their intention and what's going to be their focus as they approach you intention is to be in a harmonious connection with you balanced give and take relationship and their focus will be to give this relationship a fair chance their aim is to make clear informed decisions what's the potential the potential most of you guys will find yourself in a soulmate relationship and with six of swords someone is definitely returning to you after feeling in a certain way about you i want you to affirm this reading with your like and your comment you could type in completion now moving on to oracle messages we have elimination i am eliminating anything or anyone that could come between us we have breaking point i am reaching my breaking point i feel pushed to make a decision i don't think you are doing anything to push them it's just how they see things unsent messages i have written you several text but in the end i chicken out okay we have divine timing divine timing is at play definitely and divine union you left every part of me untouched i realize now who you are they see you as a soulmate and they want to be with you so freaking bad okay and we have telepathic i close my eyes and speak to you in a hundred silent ways that being said this was your libra reading now wait for libra versus other signs so now moving on to libra reading with air sign what's going on we start off with the fool card some of you guys are going back and forth but you want to take a leap of faith in a new direction now okay like in the past we have the three of swords which tells me that some of you guys could be going through a heartbreak you had a certain expectation from this person but you're choosing to move ahead now how is that this person is approaching you your person with the three of pentacles quite wants to be a part of you around this time uh, this person might use excuses to be in touch with you this, like this could be regarding some help but this person isn't being honest with you they are still keeping on to secrets their current feelings towards you their current feelings they do have a lot of interest in you they do see you as someone who they would want to know more okay and their offer but mind you if you're dealing with an air sign things will however go slow they do want to be a part of you but they will not want to give you full commitment okay the major issue in this situation the major issue in the situation this person could be at a distance from you or this person still wants to be completely sure before choosing you they will take more time they just want to be patient and uh, slow in terms of understanding you that being said you could type in 444 for stability and like the video to affirm the reading thank you so much moving on to libra's dealing with water sign pisces cancer scorpio well currently most of you guys could just be wanting to stay emotionally independent you are just wanting to stay focused on your finances in the recent past some of you guys could be in communication with your person in terms of your person how is that they are approaching you your person is somewhat very controlling dominating uh, sometimes detached their feelings towards you their feelings towards you this person is keeping their uh, feelings hidden secretive okay why so what is that they want with you when I mean, they definitely are holding on to some sort of grudge they seem a little upset with you if you ask me okay with the king of swords uh, they might want to understand you deeper before finally opening up but what is that they want with you this person definitely is serious about you there's no doubt about it but this person might however confuse you with their action we have two aces so this will definitely go through a new start you just got to be very honest with this person the moment you speak something that they find slightly on a sneaky or a deceptive side they might want to cut you off so just take it as a uh, suggestion or a warning what like whatever fe feels right uh, if so far this connected i would ask you to type in 777 for more clarity and do like the video to affirm this reading thank you libra david fire sign sorry we have king of cups so around this time you're heavily in your emotions okay you do think about this person a lot but you might not be expressing it much you're a little on the shy side how is your person approaching you your person wants to get married or have a future with you 
this person sees you as someone who they want to hold on to in terms of their major feelings their feelings we get two cards okay we have the fool card and the strength card so this person sees you as someone who they are deeply passionate for and they do not want to give up on so regardless of how old you guys um this this relationship could be this person all like all always feels very special bond to you the, the, there is no lack of pa uh, passion or loss of passion or desire here regardless of how long you've been dating this person still has those uh, emotions for you right from the start so let like, nothing much changes in terms of the outcome outcome with the wheel of fortune this connection moves forward uh, we have two major arcana cards we have the ten of pentacles and the king of cups most of you guys have found your soulmate and it's about few months before you could finally commit to each other i would ask you to type in 10 10 like the video and affirm the reading thank you so moving on to libra's dealing with earth sign what's going on we have the four of cups some of you guys could be feeling like you guys are stuck in some sort of bad situation without any ending or without any closure how is your person approaching you i mean regardless of what you feel this person has a lot of emotions for you like could be someone who's very shy so mostly tries to keep their feelings to themselves since this person isn't expressive enough you do feel left out okay in terms of what's they got for you with page of pentacles they, they do have a lot of attachment a lot of attraction towards you and what is that they truly want with you with three of wands yes this person will be slow with their approach no doubt about it but this person definitely looks forward to invest in this relationship it's going to go slow but this person is definitely reaching out and you guys will probably get in that communication or that clarity that you were seeking okay for some of you this could be someone who's slightly on a younger side but god plans with you so there's no reason to panic so far if this reading resonated i would ask you to type in uh, 888 for stability and success you got to be patient with this person because they do not like to be forced if you find yourself in a complicated situation i encourage you to book a tarot reading for guidance tarot can offer you truth clarity and direction guiding you through challenges with solutions and renewed confidence in your path forward so if you feel you need one you could reach out via etsy divine love tarot by sai or come via whatsapp thank you so much